Good day. The title of our research is Content Analysis of the Junior High School Robotics Intelligence Machine in the Division of Cabinet Problems, Basis for Technical Assistance. The researchers, yours truly, Loida A. Arsen, Master Teacher to Applied National High School, Arvin A. Marinduca, Head Teacher to of the Data City Science National High School, and Dr. Riza D. Severano, Education Program Supervisor 1 in Science, Post Division Office. For the introduction of our research, according to the Republic Act 2067, also known as the Science Act of 1958, promotes and bolsters science research as an effective instrument to intensify the science and technology research and development for national progress. The law is provided by the incumbent administration to advancing science and technology innovation in the country as stated in the Philippine Development Plan 2017-2022. The six-year development plan supports science, research, and development productivity and innovation to accelerate technology adoption and stimulate innovation in all economic sectors as foundation of a globally competitive knowledge economy, according to NEDA in 2017. Although several in-set and capability workshops, both for students and research advisors, were conducted in the Division of Cavite, this is just the call to be persistent in the research manuscripts presented during the annual science fair. This implies that the mentioned training and workshop do not directly address the needs of the student researchers and research advisors. Over the years, there is still limited literature with regards to content analysis of researches, specifically in the school's division of Kabita. A thorough content analysis of the existing pool of researches is pursued to help pinpoint the specific concern that needs greater technical assistance for improvement, such improvements in the conduct of scientific research within the division of Kabite will strengthen not only the science research instruction in the province, but it will also pave way to produce scientifically literate science students towards the continuous progress and development of the country. For the research question of this study, the main purpose of this study is to ascertain the strengths and weaknesses of junior high school robotics intelligence machine within the province of Kabite through a systematic content analysis. Specifically, the researcher seeks to answer the following questions. First, what is the percentage of the submitted research papers which comply the Intel ISAC guidelines in terms of the following? Research title, research abstract, introduction, review of related literature, materials and methods, results and discussion, summary conclusion and recommendations, literature cited and bibliography, research ethics and forms. Second, what is the percentage of the submitted research papers which did not comply the Intel ISAC guidelines in terms of the following? Research title, research abstract, introduction, review of related literature, materials and methods, results and discussion, summary conclusion and recommendations, literature cited or bibliography, research ethics and forms. Third, what is the percentage of the submitted research papers which completely satisfy the Intel ISAC guidelines? For the scope and limitation of this study, the primary purpose of this study is to evaluate the SIPs in the division of Kabita. The purpose of the evaluation is to determine the strengths and the weaknesses of the researches based on the guidance stipulated in the Intel ISAC rules. The said SIPs were the submitted entries for the SIP competition Robotics Intelligence Machine Category during the 2019 Division Festival of Talents in Science, the Division of Kabita Province. In this study, the research manuscripts from the junior high schools for individual and team categories were evaluated. The strengths and weaknesses of the researches were determined using a validated researcher made tool that determines whether or not the research satisfies the Intel ISAC guidelines. Content analysis of the research paper using the tool focused only on whether the research satisfied the guidelines for its research paper component. The extent of how the research satisfied this guidance is not part of the study. For the sampling, upon securing approval from the EPS in science and the SDRC, the same subjected for the evaluation were all the investigatory projects submitted as entries during the 2019 BFOT in science Robotics Intelligence Machine Junior High School level. The said SIPs included entries both in the individual and team category. For the data collection, the research instrument utilized a researcher-made checklist adapted from the 2019 Intel ISAC guidelines. 
The checklist is composed of 50 yes or no questions arranged according to the different parts of the research paper. For the discussion of results and recommendations, science investigation plays a vital role in the development of the community. The quality of how it is made dictates the result of the study. This part of the study presents the result of the content analysis done out of the three science investigatory projects under robotics intelligence machine. Category of the junior high school submitted during the DFOP conducted during the school year 2018-2020. For the discussion and results, Table 1, Percentage compliant, non-compliant to Intel ISAP guidelines. Must comply the search part based on the Intel ISAP guidelines. The title, the abstract, the introduction, the background of the study, statement of the problems of the study, scope and limitation of the study, review of related literature, materials and methods, results and discussion, summary, conclusion and recommendation, literature cited or references, research ethics and research forms, get 100%. There, were, there was no research part that was not complied. Finally, results indicated that one of the research paper was fully complied with the Intel ISAP guidelines. For the Table 2, the scores of science investigatory project analysis based on the Intel ISAP guidelines. This table shows the score of various science investigatory projects and its criteria based on the Intel ISAP guidelines. In the process of the analysis, those with high scores had the most compliant in the set guidelines, while those with this course had the most number of errors committed. The results show that the part of the materials and methods got 7, title, abstract, results and discussion, and research ethics got 5, score and limitation to study, as well as review of related literature got 4, were the components with this course. While the components with most errors include background of the study, statement of the problem, summary conclusion, and recommendation get 3, significance of the study and research forms get 2, literature cited or references get 1. During the process of the content analysis done, it was observed that those on the part of the science investigatory, the author and authors have minimal entry. In the part of the research of the materials and methods where the scores are high, was attributed to the fact that most of the research studies conducted didn't require mentioned category. Table 3 is the percentage of the science investigatory project that completely satisfied the Intel ISAP guidelines. There was only one research paper submitted for senior high school robotics intelligence machine. Both were individual and team category out of 36 senior high schools in the division of Cavite. It is alarming that this kind of research was in the focus of research among the senior high school in the division of Cavite. Thus, it was recommended by the researchers to strengthen the researches on robotics intelligence machine for it is now the trends of science nationally and internationally. Thank you and good day.